Birds Art Life by Keo McClear really is about birds, art, and life. It is a gem of a book. McClear attaches herself to a birder as a mentor and uh, trying to get herself out of a creative rut. Every sentence of this book is a finely crafted gem. I could just imagine her sitting there writing and then rewriting and then rewriting and, and uh, taking out all the things that weren't needed in there in order to produce these, these wonderful polished sentences. This book really is an antidote and a bit of a solve and um, it provides solace. It's, it's comforting in a way, although it's not always easy. You can open this book to any page, read any paragraph, and there's a really strong chance that that paragraph will captivate you and will have some statement about life on Earth that makes you go, huh. One winter, not so long ago, I met a musician who loved birds. This musician, who was then in his mid-30s, had found he could not always cope with the pressures and disappointments of being an artist in a big city. He liked banging away on his piano like Fats Waller, but performing and promoting himself made him feel anxious and depressed. Very occasionally, his depression served him well and allowed him to write lonesome songs of love. But most of the time, it just aided him. When he fell in love with birds and began to photograph them, his anxieties dissipated. The sound of birdsong reminded him to look outwards at the world.